Steve here out in uh, Gainesville, Texas at the show, Tex Oma uh, F100 Roundup. And yes. I think I always want to mess it. I always want to say Tex Oma for some reason. That's weird, I know. Uh, maybe because I'm Springfield and I'm not around Texas stuff. Um, it is a beautiful day out here, and uh, right here we're sitting on a beautiful truck, but you're actually building something else. What's the other one you're building? Real quick? Building a 71 F100. Doing fat bands, front suspension, Mustang. That's nice. Uh, four link rear with the Explore 8.8 rear end. Are you okay with four link rear? Because then you can't really haul anything. You're not, you're not planning on hauling anything? No, these, are, these trucks are retired. So. <laughs> that's kind of how I think. Yeah, I, like that. I have a work truck, so. Yeah, that's cool. Hey, uh, what, what is the truck for sitting here? Is this? this is a 69. 69, and you got it from where? We got this truck from uh, Brian Pope in Smyrna, Tennessee. Uh, Pope's Hot Rods. And it was pretty much done the way you wanted it? Pretty much, I put a five-speed in it since I got it from him. Which five-speed? I uh, put a TKO 600. Nice. Everyone buys T5s and stuff, but I feel like if you, if you can do it, you can do it. I bought it, everything from American Powertrain. It was just a bolt-in thing, basically. Uh, made it real simple. That's cool. I like your tire. Man. Yeah, it's actually a good idea. I never thought to wrap the freaking yeah. Ford thing around it. And I like your cooler, too. Yeah, those are... Amazon items I just got. I need a spare. I like to drive the truck, so. Yeah, I like that. That's cool. Well, hey, let's, let's look at your tail. Yeah. Man, that is clean. These stuff things I've never seen before. Yeah, those were on it uh, when I bought it. That's cool. Yeah, you can always tell, but what, what year did you say it was again? It's a uh, 69. 69, because about that time they started doing these reflectors yes. and stuff, kind of pins it out, like, you know, and then I think in the 70s they did one here, right? Yes. Yeah. I think they started that in did 70. Uh -huh. Did away with the side one. Well, tell us about your wheels right here. The wheels are uh, American Racing just from the custom shop. And those are 5 on 5.5 or whatever? Those are the, 5 on 5. And you can get those custom? 5 on 5 and a half. 5 on 5 and a half. You can. If you go through the custom shop, you can get them pretty much back the right, whatever backspace you want. Mm -hmm. you know, and wheel. I like your Is that a 9 inch, right? It's a 9 inch. Is that an axle flip? Looks like it. Yeah, yes. it is. That's uh -huh. cool. Do you like it? it? Still rides well. Still rides great. Cool. Do you mind if I open up the? Not go ahead. Tell me about the interior. The interior is pretty much stock. It was like that when I bought it. I like that stereo system. Thing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the sound of the yeah, Bluetooth that, speaker, right? Yeah, that yeah, that's it. That's all stereo I need. Yes, exactly. Yeah. I can get all the good songs anyway. They're what you I think's good. Did you have a hard time finding that shifter? No. Put that seat. No, that all came. American powertrain. Do you know, is this an original Ranger? Focus in on that Ranger spot right there. It is. Yeah, that's cool. Mine came as a Ranger too, but I don't have a, I don't have a little fancy chrome size and stuff like that. It's really nice, man. So this, you're still, are you rocking any AC? I you have AC. Texas, you do? I have AC and power steering that I bought from a guy in oh, Arkansas, yeah, Oklahoma. I haven't got it installed yet. So. I have all the factory stuff, so, yeah. I like this chrome piece right here, and I love the, the black on chrome accents, and I'm really yes. glad that, that you have that. I, when I see those, I'm like, oh, I want one, so I just want, like, sometimes people take them all off, because they, they yes. did on my truck, and I like that people are keeping them on. Yeah, are they reproducing those, probably? They're reproducing uh, most of the moldings. Uh, Dennis Carpenter. Uh, the, uh, I don't know what you call the ones over the door. There, yeah, the, those, the, were, those were only when I got it, but on the truck I'm building, it doesn't have them, but I like them. Cool. The window crack. Well, there, there, so. see, I don't have AC in my truck, but it's the best one. It's nice exactly. and cool, you know. Plus, you can always no, crack, it's coming. You can always crack that vent. <laughs> exactly. Is it, it says 390 on the side. Do you have a 390? Oh, wow. And you got front stock disc brakes. And uh, then, is that... I Actually, guess, that looks like I think stock. Brian probably put those on there. And I looked underneath there. You got, you still have twin IVs, but it looks like they're coming yes. lower. It's twin IVs. Chassis tech. Chassis tech. Okay. Uh -huh. Yeah, let's see the engine. Actually, hold on one second. Look at this. He did like a flat black on this. Can you get a good shot of that? Now, why'd you do that? Is there a cool story about it? 
Yeah, the cat jumped up there and scratched <laughs> it, so I had to do something with it. It's funny how uh, one bad thing can turn into a good thing. I really like it. It's subtle, yeah. and then it also sort of sets them apart from the rest. It's really cool. All right, I'm ready. I'm ready for that engine. It's not just special. No, that's perfect. That is awesome. 392 valve. Is there anything done to the motor? Is that stock? No. Bone stock. Sometimes stock is best. I like that. See, this is something cool that doesn't always there is the, the brackets and stuff that holds the, the jack on. I mean, the, people take those that's, away and throw them yeah, away. And that's actually, now they're a rare thing. You know? That's actually out of a 2010. So really? the jack that was in here wouldn't work. It usually sits so. right here, but I've never seen one like yeah. that. Okay, well, that, I, that uh, explains it. I put that in a few days ago. I didn't. Well, you need to get stranded without it. We do drive the truck, so. That's really cool. That is awesome. This is beautiful. These are really rare right here. To find those, the, uh, the Ranger, uh, people just buy them and paint them, but it's really beautiful. Man, this is a beautiful truck. Pope, yeah. Oh, yeah. Zoom in on Pope's hot rod real quick. He did a great work. You don't recall, he's got a lot of trucks. There you go. <laughs> Hey man, thank you so much for letting me speak to you. I appreciate it. Appreciate it. Thank you. Hey, I hope you guys enjoy the truck. Talk to you later.